hey guys welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here today we are doing another walmart grocery haul for you guys we are currently sitting in the parking lot at walmart waiting for our pickup order so we're gonna do that and i also have to go inside of walmart because i wasn't thinking every time i do a pickup i just have groceries on my mind and i don't think about things like if i'm out of like body wash or something like that which i need some shampoo and conditioner some body wash like a couple of things and so i have to run in and do that and i'll also have um three bags of diapers that are size newborn that I need to see if I can exchange. I'm not really sure if I can because I'm pretty sure they came from Target online and then Amazon so I don't know if Walmart has the same like count of these particular diapers so that I could exchange them out or whatever but Miles is wearing ones and twos already so he's wearing twos to bed for sure and so the newborn ones like don't fit him at all so hopefully I can exchange them we don't have a Target close by so the bag that's from Target I can't I can't just like go to Target and then Amazon I don't even know how to go about doing that so we're just gonna see but anyways i'm gonna do all that get the pickup order and then whenever we get home i'll show you guys what we got okay you guys so we just got home and we got more stuff than i realized from walmart but this is everything we got i'm just gonna go ahead and start over here um well way over here on this side so over here we just have a loaf of bread some mountain dew for josh some grapes eggs and then we both wanted some ice cream i wanted chocolate and josh wanted some vanilla so we got two things of ice cream josh wanted the vanilla because he wanted Wanted to make like a sundae and I'll show you we got like some hot fudge and stuff for it we got our produce right here so we have an onion we have bananas strawberries we have a red pepper and a green pepper and the onion and the peppers are for a dinner that we're gonna make this week we ended up with a whole bunch of drinks and I'll explain to you why usually they never have these jugs of Minute Maid and so that's why you guys see us get the cartons of Minute Maid for the boys but they go through their drinks so fast so I put all of these in here including the Sunny D because I was like they're gonna be out of like two out of the three of these and then they weren't so we got the berry punch minute made the fruit punch minute made and sunny d so the boys will be good on drinks for a while i got these twisted pretzel sticks because my sister allison brought some of these over here one day whenever she came over to help me with all of the kids after miles was born and this was one of the flavors that she brought over and she made me try them and they're really really good you guys if you haven't tried them you should try them they have like two other flavors that are also good as well but this one was my favorite and then we got a gallon of milk a case of water some maple brown sugar oatmeal because we are just about out of that and we keep this in our house oatmeal is also supposed to be good for your milk supply so i'm trying to make sure that i eat plenty of oatmeal okay so with the condiments i ended up with a way bigger size of mayo than what i meant to get and then i ended up with a smaller bottle of ketchup than i meant to get so that happened I really wanted some of these honey roasted cashews I put it in my order last well I don't know how long ago it was a few weeks ago or something and they were out of them so they had them this time and I'm really excited Josh wanted this chipotle seasoned chicken breast because he's gonna make sandwiches to take to work for lunch so we got that we got some tortilla shells for a recipe we're making this week I got some of these cookies you guys probably have noticed you haven't seen these in our hauls in a while and these used to be in like every single grocery haul because we're addicted to these there's a lot of sweets in this haul don't judge me but I've been on a sweet kick I don't even care and here's the hot fudge that we got we actually ordered the Hershey's brand and they were out of it and they substituted it for the Smucker's brand but we haven't had either one of these before so we're just gonna try it out we needed some green beans and we tried to put a bunch of cans in there and they said there was only one can available which was weird to me but we got one can of green beans we got a bunch of bars back here okay these bars come in handy for me and for the kids since i have a newborn in the house right now these are great for in the mornings i got these i haven't had them in a while but i used to eat them a lot whenever i had like just had bryce and i would eat these kind of like first thing in the morning when i just needed to get something in my body i do have a whole bunch of cliff bars that we just got from sam's club so i have those as well but i got these for me and then i got the boys there let's see their apple cinnamon fruit and grain bars and then I got them some of these Sunbelt Bakery oats and honey chewy granola bars and then also the chocolate chip ones you guys this brand right here is so much better than the the Quaker oats or what is it the regular chewy bars that you get I hate those but these so good I got the kids some different gummies this time I try to mix it up because they eat a lot of fruit snacks these are really good actually my little sister buys these as well and I tried them at her house and they're really good we got this kit to make for dinner one night and we're just gonna see see how we like it we've never 
had that before. I got my spinach and ricotta raviolis to have for lunch one day. Me and Bryce love this. I got my prego sauce to go with it. We got some ready whip for iced coffee and for the ice cream sundaes. Josh wanted provolone cheese for his sandwiches for lunch. We got some Colby Jack cheese for dinners this week that we're going to be doing. We were out of craft singles, so we got that. Got some cream cheese for a recipe this week. Cracker barrel cheese and pepperonis because we have a whole bunch of Ritz crackers, and so we like to, you guys know, if you've been watching for a while, we like that as a snack. This Rotel and this heavy uh, whipping cream is also for a recipe. The recipe that I keep referring to is we're making these chicken, this chicken fajita bake that we found on Pinterest, so we'll see how that ends up being. We got some sour cream for our dinners because apparently we're going to have two different Mexican style dinners this week. Oh, and then we got fajita mix. It said to get taco seasoning and I thought, well, it's a fajita recipe, so I might as well get fajita seasoning. So hopefully it's good. I got Liam these because he was talking about wanting red jello, so I got him that. We got some curly fries because we're going to have hamburgers one day this week. Josh told me to get these and see if the boys like these. I like these, but I figured the boys would like these for a quick breakfast some mornings. We got some waffles for the boys in the mornings because we were completely out of those. We ran out of pancake mix, so this is just the pancake mix that we buy. Josh also got or wanted me to get these two cans of biscuits because he makes his own sausage and biscuits in the morning to take for work for breakfast. We also needed some more of this seasoning. We used this on a lot of things and we were out of it. So we got that. I want to try this pizza. I really like the like margarita style pizzas and I've never had a California kitchen, wait, California pizza kitchen pizza before. I've never had this brand of pizza before and my cousin Laura keeps telling me that it's really good. So we got our hamburger buns back here for when we have our burgers one night. Also got a tombstone five cheese pizza because the boys might not might not like that. I had one of you guys tell me to give you like a meat warning. So here's the meat warning. I'm about to show you guys all of our meat. So we got our ripe bacon. This is the best bacon ever if you guys haven't tried it. We got a pound of hamburger meat for that taco kit. We got our chicken for the chicken fajita bake, which they substituted it. So hopefully this is enough chicken in here for that. And then we got two pounds of hamburger meat so we can have cheeseburgers one night. And then Josh's sausage for his sausage biscuits that he makes himself in the mornings. Um, I think that that's everything. Wow, that was fast. I do think that I showed everything though. Yes. And I'm going to show you guys real quick too, like the stuff that I grabbed while I was in Walmart just now as well. Okay, so we're doing this in the living room because there's no room on my kitchen counters right now. But I got this Febreze Air. I love Febreze. We were completely out. I needed some shampoo and Tresemme usually works pretty good, but I think this is like new. I don't know if you guys can tell. I don't know. It's They had some new Tresemmes. Anyways, maximum lengths. I don't know. We'll see if we like that. I needed some body wash. I love the cucumber one cucumber and green tea and then I am almost out of nursing pads I've already went through almost a whole box actually I have went through over a hundred nursing pads because I had a whole box and then I had a partial box that my sister gave me and I'm almost out of nursing pads so we got those and then I was only able to exchange one out of the three bags of diapers which was unfortunate I guess I'm stuck with the two bags of newborn diapers that I can't seem to get rid of but I got them some size two we've never tried the Hello Bello diaper diapers before so I figured this would be the perfect time to try them out. They are actually like a dollar cheaper I think than the Pampers that I like exchanged for. So we'll find out if we like these because if I like these I might just buy this kind for him honestly. They're really not a bad price. I looked at the boxes to see and they're not a bad price at all but so I grabbed that stuff while I was inside of the store. So when I was in the living room I realized that I didn't show you guys these <laughs> because they were hidden back here but I saw them from the living room. So these are more bars that I got the boys. They really like these chocolate brownie Z bars so yeah literally so many bars that I bought. But anyways, for real, I think that's everything. Okay, at least one person's gonna judge me. I know it's gonna happen, but I'm gonna show you guys anyways because I didn't really mean to do this. Just look. Okay, so it's kind of dark in my cabinet and it looks like everything's just thrown in here and I promise it's not. It looks that way because I have these bins that I got off of Amazon to put like all the snacks and stuff in. So there's four of them in here but for some reason so all these chips we got from Sam's Club the other day and Josh took them all out of the box and put them in here um and now it looks chaotic but anyways I look like I'm ready to run a daycare center look at all these 
fruit snacks and bars. These back here are mine, but still, like, we have bars for like the next six months. It's fine. And chips, apparently. I really did not realize that I got that many. Oh well. Okay guys, so that's everything that we got at Walmart today. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, please consider subscribing and we'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.